Sorry, y'all. Y'all know how my work signal is. Um, anyway, I'm here to step on some toes this morning. Um, and just basically let you know that um, if you are in a season and you're wondering why you're still in that season and you're saying, God, I'm ready. I'm ready to be done with this season. Why am I still here? What's the hold up? I want to let you know you are the hold up. And I know that's going to make some people mad, but I want to share the truth with you because what we don't realize most of the time is that when we are in a season, especially one that we are so ready to hurry up and get out of, we are the holdup. We're the reason that we have not reached breakthrough. We are the reason that we are still here because in our rush to get out of that season, we have skipped some steps. We have missed some things. We have gone around some crucial points in the journey trying to get out of it. And the thing about God is that God does not promote you through shortcuts. So whatever it is that you're going through, you have to go through it. You can't go around it. You can't go under it or over it. You have to go through it. And so if you're in a season right now and you're trying to figure out, you know, God, why am I still here? Um, and you might think you're ready. A lot of times we have a real good trying to tell God when we're ready, um, when he should promote us, when we're ready to be promoted, when we're ready to receive the blessing, when we're ready to move on. And God is like, no, you're not ready. You haven't cooked all the way because there are some steps that I need you to go back and do. There are some things that you have tried to get around that I need you to actually go back and do. There are some things that you didn't want to do and now you've got to go back and do it. And I'm telling you this because I've experienced it in my own journey. Um, there are a lot of times where I have had to repeat seasons and repeat steps and repeat and retake tests because um, I was so ready to hurry up and get out of the season that I was in or hurry up and get past the test that I went around what God was trying to take me through. And the only way that you're ever going to learn or grow or that God is going to be able to build in you the character that's necessary for you to move forward is for you to go through it. And we always want to cut corners. We always want to go, you know, get somehow get out of what it is. Um, and I know because I'm in a season like that where I wish I wish I wasn't in this season and I wish that there was a way, you know, a quick fix or a shortcut, but there's not. And the awesome thing about God is that he doesn't mind you having a temper tantrum and he doesn't mind hurting your feelings if it is to help you and to better you um, because he ultimately has a purpose and a plan for all of us. And so the season that you're in is growing you, it's preparing you, it's making you ready, it's stripping the things that don't need to be there, it's tearing the things off of you that don't need to be there, it's removing the people that don't need to come with you into your next season. And so while you think because it's been a year or two years or three years that you've been in this same spot, you think that you're ready. The reality is, is that you are the holdup. What have you been avoiding? What have you not been doing? What have you been being disobedient to God towards God in? Has God been asking you to do certain things and you haven't done them yet? Um, has God been moving you in a certain direction and you won't go in that direction because you're scared or it's not what you want? Are you still fighting God's plan for your life? Because if you are still fighting God's plan for your life, then you're not ready to move to move forward and you are the holdup. And so if you're stuck in a season, I want you to know you're the holdup. Get with it.